This is just a quick recording on how to create a virtual machine for Metasploitable. Uh, when you download, download Metasploitable, it's downloaded as a zip file, and to once you've extracted it, you'll find <coughs> pardon me, that it's in um, VMDK format, which is for um, VMware. So what we're going to do is we're just going to create a virtual machine for uh, in um, VirtualBox and we'll create it so that we can use the VMDK um, hard drive or storage from our Metasploitable. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to create a new virtual machine. So we're going to go to um, new I'm just going to call it um, Metasploitable-test. Right. It's going to be Linux. And I'm just going to put it as Debian 64. And I'm going to go next. I'll keep it at that, um, that amount of RAM for now. And here is I'm going to... This is where we um, start looking at the VMDK. So instead of create a virtual hard disk now, I'm going to use an external um, hard disk file. I'm just going to look for one and I'll, I will search. All right, oops, sorry, I'll add. Um, I've just downloaded it. So it's just in here. And I'm just going to select the Metasploitable VMDK and go OK and choose and then create okay so now you can see that I have my Metasploitable test and it's using a VMDK what I can then do is I can export it as an OVA and if I want to I can then re-import it back into VirtualBox as a VDI uh, that's if you want to otherwise it just works as it is okay and that's all there is to it